Murphy, tell us about your day. What have you been doing here? Well, I was actually training with the players since it was really insane to do. It's a once in a lifetime experience. And you got to go to the locker room oh. and what was that like? That, that was really cool. Everyone was nice around there. It was a really sense of like a team effort. What's been your favorite part so far? Definitely playing with them, warming up. Yeah, maybe even like jogging around the whole thing. That oh, was a great. Experience. What position do you play? I play striker for uh, my team. So can I guess is Sebastian Javinko your favorite player? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I like also like Josie Altidore. Mm -hmm. I think he's good. What made you choose Toronto FC as your your team to support? Well, um, for my team in Cheshire, they're the same exact colors for, as the team, so I just kind of picked up a liking to them, and then I got hooked. Did you believe it when you heard it, you were coming up here? Actually, I didn't hear. My dad kept it a surprise, and then they picked me up, and I just kind of was shocked. Where did you think you were going? I thought we were just going to explore the city, maybe eat somewhere wasn't really expecting this. And when they brought you in the boardroom, what did you think? Uh, I was still confused after like an hour here. It's really uh, sh shocking, really. So what was the feeling like when you actually got to sign the contract? <laughs> it was pretty cool. Still don't have that signature down yet, but um, <laughs> I, that's, that's it. <laughs> So you're looking forward to the game tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. It's actually going to be my first Toronto game I'm seeing because we live in Connecticut. It's an eight-hour drive up, so we don't do it often. Was it different practicing with the players? Was Were they faster or better? What did you think when you got on the pitch? With well, it, they, were, they, were pretty, they were a lot better than what I'm usually good like used to but so it was a cool experience so I guess all your teammates back home are going to be so jealous of you when you go back there yeah, yeah definitely so Chris, yeah you planned it first last year yeah and then you had to wait you want to talk about uh, the, that bit of a wait and why, why you had to wait and why this year was the right time what is it um we we had this going for yeah almost a year I thought we were just going to go up watch the game stay at a hotel, look at the sights, and then that was it. But it was it was a little hard waiting for it because the days just couldn't go any slower. So it, it was just, it was awesome finally getting here. How long have you been a fan? I've been a fan for three or four years when I, um, when I played soccer on my team. And uh, how good a soccer player are you, do you think? I think I'm I think I'm all right. Yeah. That's like, I don't want to be too up, up like on myself. So, yeah, I think I'm okay.